guys how are you today i hope everybody's doing fine today today's video we're going to discuss a little bit interesting topic for some of us it's interesting and it's informative at the same time now uh the video basically uh talks about roblox characters and gfx what is gfx what is a roblox gfx what do you do with it how do you use it? How do you do it actually? So we're gonna basically talk about the basics and what do you need for it? And then we're gonna bring up in another video, how do we actually do it? But before I go on, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and like this video. Thank you very much. So a GFX is basically stands for the graphics. It's a graphic driver, it's a link, it's um, an effect, graphics effect that's used to um, make something look so much way better. Now, if I say how way better, let's say the Roblox quality picture looks different, all right? It's a high quality image that can be done using specific programs. In the GFX world, people are using Blender. Why do they use it? Because it's an open source uh, program. It's free, you can download it. You can just hit Blender download and you will go to directly to the link. It's very easy to download it. And every couple of months they've got an update for it. So you can download it and you can find it for free and use it. If you look here, this is an example of a Roblox GFX video. So you can do pictures and you can do videos like these videos. These are very simple and easy videos, which are not very simple and easy basically, but anyways, you can do that quickly using the Blender software. How can you make the GFX? Okay. The requirements for the GFX are basically, you need a computer for that. And you need to download Roblox Studio. You need to have a Roblox account and then download Roblox Studio. You need to download Blender and then you need to find the reg. I will do these instructions in my next video, part two, which will be explaining all of these things. Now, how does the Roblox Studio looks like? It will look basically like this and you're going to load your character. And then as you can see, this is my character. All right. This is my Rima Coolblox character. Uh, you can download it and then you will see your character there. From here, you can start when you reach this point. I will tell you the rest of the things that you can do in my next video. So this is an introduction about how can you start creating your Roblox character in, uh, as a GFX and what do you need to do all of that. And the steps of doing all of these will be in my next video. So I hope you learned something from that and I hope you enjoyed it. And let's see if we can do it together in my next video. All right. Thank you very much for watching. Again, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe.